Hi there, I'm Dr. Jim Collins, and I'd like to spend a little bit of time talking about Alzheimer's and nutrition. Alzheimer's is one of my favorite topics. I've studied it for years and years, and I have come to understand that nutrition plays a huge part in the development of Alzheimer's disease and in the maintenance of Alzheimer's disease. Did you know one in eight baby boomers will develop Alzheimer's disease? one in 10 Americans of all ages will suffer from Alzheimer's disease, and 100,000 people die every single year due to Alzheimer's disease. And also, did you know, diet is important because it's associated with a lot of diseases that are related to Alzheimer's disease. For instance, hypertension, elevated cholesterol, diabetes, heart disease, stroke, vitamin deficiency, and obesity, just to name a few. Each of these conditions are connected with Alzheimer's disease. So I wrote a, an article on this. If you're interested, go ahead and click the link below. But I'd like to give you a little bit more information. Get more anti-Alzheimer's foods and drinks into your diet. Why not? They're all healthy. They're going to be good for your heart. And whatever is, this is a good rule of thumb, whatever is good and healthy for the heart is also healthy for the brain. Something that my wife turned me on to, um, curcumin. And this is an amazing thing because I believe it, it contains the highest levels of antioxidants that you can get in a supplement or, or curcumin, you know, however curcumin, cur, you know, what, how, however you pronounce it, you pronounce it. But it's extremely important to get into your diet. I take a thousand milligrams a day and I, I've noticed a lot. It's also a fantastic anti-inflammatory. Get cinnamon in your diet. That is an anti-Alzheimer's food. Fruits and vegetables, of course, that's a no-brainer but fruits that are high in polyphenols, for instance, berries. Strawberries, blueberries, anything in the berry family are great as an anti-Alzheimer's food, but they're also anti-inflammatories. Eat more foods rich in B-complex vitamins, especially B6, B12, and folates. Eating fish three times a week is recommended and might reduce the risk of Alzheimer's by 40 to 60%. I'm getting more seafood in my diet because I like those statistics. Eating any of these foods is also good for preventing obesity, cancer, and heart disease, which are all associated with Alzheimer's disease. You can also get more turkey and chicken, wild caught, sa caught salmon, eggs, soybeans, avocados, shellfish, dark chocolate, wine, which is one of my favorites, asparagus, walnuts, cherries, and apples. Get more of these things in your diet and you will reduce your risk for developing Alzheimer's disease. So again, I wrote an article on this. If you're interested, click the link below. If you are a licensed healthcare professional and you want CEUs on this topic, follow that link. So thank you for spending time with me. I love talking about Alzheimer's, especially Alzheimer's and nutrition. My name is Dr. Jim Collins, and I'll be talking to you soon.